is the most powerful explosion in the universe? Could it be a grenade? Maybe it's a stick of dynamite. Could it be fireworks? It's most likely to be a hydrogen bomb. But all of those things are wrong. The gamma ray burst is the most powerful explosion in the universe. When gamma ray bursts are in action, the explosion has the power of 1,000 suns. The explosion is big, and when I say big, I mean big. If one went off near us, it would be like millions of hydrogen bombs exploding all over the planet. The first gamma ray bursts ever detected were in the 1960s by American military satellites. Satellites were monitoring Soviet nuclear activities when they accidentally discovered something even more interesting. Powerful bursts of gamma rays shooting out in all directions in space. Gamma rays are detected in space every day or so. And ever since they were discovered 24 years ago, gamma ray bursts have astronomers stuck. These very short, high-energy flashes only last for a few seconds, then fade away, never showing up in the same place in the sky twice. Until just last year, scientists thought that gamma ray bursts came from somewhere within our Milky Way galaxy, but new information leads us to believe that gamma ray bursts probably take place billions of light years beyond the Milky Way galaxy. The gamma ray bursts that astronomers see are from stars that have died long ago. The light that we see on Earth could be from gamma ray bursts that happened before the Earth existed. And many bursts that we see are much older than that. Gamma ray bursts are really bright. The only reason astronomers can see them outside of our galaxy is because of their brightness. Their brightness is caused by the tight beams of a gamma ray burst. The light is focused, like this flashlight. How do gamma ray bursts happen? There are a couple of ways that they might happen. One theory is that if two neutron stars had a collision, it would create enough energy to make a gamma ray burst. Another theory is when the core of a giant and heavy star collapses under its own weight to become a black hole. As that happens, the star is consumed by the black hole. Some of this material might be heated to such high temperatures that it could emit a burst of gamma rays. Scientists can now observe gamma ray bursts from NASA's Compton Gamma Ray Observatory Satellite, launched in 1991. We're finding out a lot of information about gamma ray bursts, but there is so much more to discover. Thank you.